We have been hearing a lot about the similarity of triangles since a long time, but today we are going to learn properly what is similarity of triangles and how we can say the two triangles are similar and what are those criterions uh, to say uh, what are the criteria like after meeting or after achieving those criteria, the two triangles can be shaped to be a similar, similar triangles, right? So first, you know, I just want to tell you, just first time you need to see how is the shape of the two triangles. Right to be a similar first you need to look how is the shape suppose you have a triangle something like this and another triangle you have a very thing a very small something like this okay now see if you see one 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 uh, one side is very lengthy another side is a little bit smaller and one is very very smaller and if you see here almost it looks you know they all sides are all, almost look same so if you see if you compare the shape now from the shape also they they don't look same so why should we consider they cannot be similar. Right? Similarity means shape should be same, but the sides may be different. And if you look, if you look something another triangle, something like this. Okay. Now see here. If you see these two two, two triangles, now see here. Here you you get something. You know, it, this side and this side matches a little. Similarly, this side and this side matches a little. And here also, if you see, you can compare these two triangles. Looks a little bit same, but this one is bigger. Right? This one is bigger, and this one is a little bit smaller. So. First, first atom is looking shape. If you if you see the shape almost same, yeah, you can go for the second step. Now, second step is looking your size. Looking look the size of the sides. If the sides, you know, are exactly same, you know, like if this size and this size was exactly the same, then it can be directly you can say like looking same also, and the sizes are also equal. So that time you can say they they might be congruent, or the possibilities of becoming similar is more. But Telling size means here comes the proportionality. To be a two sides, uh, to be the similar two triangles, their sides, size in the sense I mean to say side, okay, you need to look the side actually. Sides are whether proportional or not. Look at the sides whether they are proportional or not. Like if it is if it is four, it should be something. I'm just giving roughly. Suppose it's one centimeter, it is four centimeter. If it is suppose two centimeter, this side should be like four times this. Like this is one centimeter then it's it, it is 4 centimeters means 4 times it is if it is 2 it should be something like 2 then it should be uh, bigger than that uh, so something like 4 times it is 8 centimeter you know and similarly uh, another you should get something uh, you should get like something if it is uh, 1.5 all right suppose if it is 1.5 then you should get 4 times of this you should get this side 4 times of this 1.5 and that's going to be uh, 6 right this should be 6 centimeters so in this way if you see like this side side uh, this side and this side are proportional this side and this side are proportional this side and this side are proportional so these two conditions if they are matching then we can say similarly these are the similarity triangles they are similar triangles but here we're gonna learn properly one by one what are the, the this is you know the basic criterion I'm talking just once you see the triangles right uh, first you need to see you know the shape and the size like by w watching these things you know you can easily say whether they are going to be or not but exactly whether they are or not we need to learn the criterion basic criterions uh, of becoming the similarity all right so the first criteria is you know the first first criteria is angle 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 you know so what is angle 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 criterion it is you know like if you have the two triangles if you have the two triangles whether big or smaller that doesn't matter but if the angles all the angles all the three angles are equal like suppose this is 90 degree and this is also 90 degree suppose this is 30 degree and this is also 30 degree and if it is 60 degree this is also 60 degree because some of the inter angles of uh, inter angles should be 180 you no know? because in a triangle the sum of all inter angles should be 180 so here also we have 180 here also we have 180 like now see if you have the all angle angle and angle all are same if the like in both triangle the first triangle and in the second triangle if you see all the angles are equal so since all the angles are equal then we can say both triangles are similar right now this is the first condition if you have the all three angles equal then you can say this is these 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 two triangles are similar one more thing i want to say you here if you have in any triangle two angles equal in any triangles if two angles are equal then third side automatically equal like see here the sum is 180 right sum is 180 sum is 180 here also sum is 180 here also now two sides is given suppose this is 90 degree this is 90 degree and this is 30 and this is 30 this much you know so what should be the third value third value should be like uh, 180 minus the subtraction of these two sum of this I need to subtract that is 90 plus 30 120 I need to subtract 120 here and here also 90 plus 30 that is 120 
So if you subtract 180 and I'm gonna get 60. So this side is my 60 degree. And here also similarly I will get 60 degrees. So, so basic things is here, if you have only two angles equal in two triangles, in any two triangles, if you have the two angles equal, then you can directly say that both of these two triangles are similar. Okay. So now the second one, side, side, side. If it means like if the, all the sides are proportional, sides are proportional. This is side, side, side. Okay. If you have two triangles, something like this, draw. Now in these two triangles, if all the sides are proportional, all the sides have the same ratio, then we can say that these both triangles are uh, similar. Let me give the name to this triangle. Suppose this is triangle A, B, and C, and this triangle P, Q, and R. Let me suppose this is uh, X meter, this is Y meter, this is Z meter. Similarly here if it is X by 2 meter or uh, centimeter, whatever you can say, right? Y by 2 meter and this is also Z by 2 meter. Then if you see the ratio here, I'm going to say ratio of this AB over the PQ, okay? AB over the PQ and similarly ratio of AC over the PR, AC over the PR in the same way BC over the QR, BC over the QR. If you see the ratio, now see here what you're going to get. AB is how much? That's X. And what is PQ? PQ is X by 2. And what is AC? AC is Y. What is PR? PR is Y by 2. What is BC? BC is Z. What is QR? QR is Z by 2. And finally, see, you can cancel here. You can cancel this X and X, Y and Y, Z and Z. So this two will go upstairs, here also upstairs. Means upward it will go. So you'll get 2 over 1, 2 over 1, and 2 over 1. So finally what you get? You got the ratio of 2 ratio 1. Means this, this, this triangle ABC is just exactly twice of this, you know. If you, if you multiply this, uh, this triangle two times, right, by two, then you're going to get this bigger triangle. So there, here, both triangles have, you know, the sides in the same ratio. So they, they, you can say now these are proportional. Or now if I'm giving uh, something differently, like a uh, number, if, if this is suppose three centimeter, and it should be just double, right, twice of this. So it is, it is six centimeter. If it is suppose five centimeter, uh, it should be like ten centimeter. And if it is, uh, let me suppose it, it's, uh, again uh, 3.5 suppose okay so if it is 3.5 so it should be 7 centimeter so see here what we are going to get actually if this side is 3 this is 6 if it is 5 this is 10 and if this is 3.5 this is 7 means always the ratio is 2 ratio 1 right so the sides are proportional you know so since the sides are proportional we can say these two triangles are similar so now I can say these two triangles are similar but any two sides are proportional but the third one is not then we can't say these are proportional it means all the three sides all means every all the three sides should be proportional not only only two or only one side is proportional like like i'm giving example let me give an example very good example here suppose you have a triangle and one more bigger triangle you do have and suppose this is uh, two centimeter this is suppose 8 centimeter means 4 times bigger it is okay and if it is 3 centimeter let's say suppose this is 12 centimeter and uh, uh, let me say this is 4 centimeter okay so it should be 4 times so 16 centimeter though it's not looking just try to imagine okay now see here this this is 2 and if I'm gonna multiply by 4 I'm gonna get 8 this is 3 if I'm gonna multiply by uh, by by 4 then I'm gonna get 12 and if this is 4 again I'm gonna multiply by 4 so I'm gonna get this so exactly here all the sides are proportional but in case this was not 16 suppose this was 17 if this was 17 then what you can say it's not 4 times means this side was proportional with this side right and this side was proportional with this one but these two sides are not proportional so we can't say we can't say these are similar we can't say we should have all the sides proportional all means all the three 
if they are going to meet this condition then we can say these are similar otherwise not one more condition we do have third one that is called side angle side okay now suppose you have these two triangles one is smaller one another is bigger one let me give the name this is p q r a b and c this is 90 degree and this is also 90 degree now see here what i mean to say here if this is uh, suppose x meter and if this is suppose uh, 3x similarly if it is y and if it is 3y okay and now we don't have the information about this pr and ac just this much information we have so here just try to compare side one side is here and another side is here similarly here one side we have another side we have and here one side we have and another side we have if these two sides are proportional means this is pairing with this means these are corresponding and these are corresponding if these two corresponding sides are proportional I'm going to say if PQ over the AB right PQ over the AB similarly here QR over the BC is equal with QR over the BC so what is our third to be a uh, like third third condition is like we should have this this uh, this 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 PR proportional to AC but we don't have that information until we don't get like PR proportional to AC we can't say these are similar but one more thing we have if the angle between them is equal angle between these two sides which is here 90 degree and here also angle between these two sides is 90 degree so if two sides these two sides and between them angle you know this this these angles are equal if these two angles are equal so side angle and side side angle and side means side should be proportional and angle should be equal then in that case we can say that both triangles are similar okay now we can say this both triangles are similar so triangle PQR is similar with triangle ABC because the sides are proportional two sides are proportional and the angle between the two sides angle between those two sides which are proportional to another triangles sides right this one angle and this one angle is equal then we can say these are uh, these these two two uh, triangles are similar otherwise we can't say okay now whatever the rules we learned now we can actually prove those all angle 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 and then side 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 and the third one recently we learned side angle side this all we can prove uh, I will try to prove this later and uh, now I just want to take leave uh, I will get back in the next video goodbye